Hey you guys, I'm Stacy, and this is Gorgeously Aging. Thank you so much for being with me today. If you are brand new, a special welcome. I do hope you will consider subscribing and joining the Gorgeously Aging community. So today I'm gonna to be talking about red LED. For those of you who have been with me for a while, you know this is an important part of my anti-aging routine. And I've definitely developed some strategies to keep my skin looking younger. So I'd love to share this LED mask with you my thoughts, the price point, what the advantages and disadvantages of other masks are, and if this is worth investing your money. So if you're interested in learning more, keep on watching. So red LED has so many proven benefits. This was first discovered by NASA when they used red LED light to stimulate the growth in plants. It was further studied and it was found to have some pretty significant benefits in skin from an anti-aging perspective. The benefits actually go far beyond anti-aging, but those are the ones I'm going to focus on today. What I have found is using red LED light and that experience has spanned many different devices. So I started with a less expensive firm mask from Amazon that was a little bit uncomfortable. It had a thick plastic layer on the inside so the LED didn't get really close contact with the skin. But I used that for a while until I just found it to be too uncomfortable to continue using. And then I invested in a table lamp and this was one that sits over the face so nothing comes in direct contact with the skin. The reason I purchased that one was because it's really great for post-procedure, post-microneedling, post-mesotherapy, post-chemical peels for healing the skin. I still use that one all the time after procedures for a day-to-day -day use, I prefer a thin, flexible mask. We'll talk more about the two that I've used and the pros and cons of each. So the table LED is a really good option if you don't want to have something sitting directly on the skin. However, the disadvantage is going to be that you don't get really close contact with that LED light. It's still great for healing. It has many benefits. And again, I use mine all the time post-procedure. I use red LED every single morning. Now, up until recently, up until the last month, I was using a Boost LED mask. Now, this last month, I've been using this Current Body Skin mask exclusively. It is almost identical to the Boost mask in its design. It's flexible. The LED lights are really close to the surface, and it's cordless. This does get recharged. You hold the button down. It turns the red LED light on, and that cycles for 10 minutes. So in the morning when I get out of bed, I don't even get out of bed, I just grab it, throw it on my face, I'm not gonna put it over my head right now, throw it on my face and fall back asleep for 10 minutes. And if I'm really feeling like I want some extra rejuvenation, I'll run it for another 20 minutes or another 10 minutes if I'm, or if I'm really super tired. It's an easy way to start the day. You don't even think about it after you get into the routine and you are ensured to have a really nice dose of red LED on your face. You can also get a neck unit if you want to get that rejuvenation on the neck and decollete area. The device is $399 and I do have a 10% off code that is STACY10. Price point is a little cheaper than the Boost LED. Now I'll tell you the Boost LED is great just like this current body device. Very, very similar design, but as far as the technology and specs, they're really very much the same. So I can't say that I like one or the other, but I will say the current body price point is just a little bit better. And I think for those of you who are kind of minding your budget, that may be something to consider. So the current body mask has won in plenty of awards. And I think that in and of itself is pretty impressive. It does have four and a half out of five stars and plenty of really great reviews at currentbody.com. The technology in the mask is red LED light and near infrared light. So this isn't the kind of light that will tan your skin. It is a light that is therapeutic and will soothe wrinkles, improve skin tone and texture, and firm the skin. Results can be seen usually three or four weeks after consistent use. I think for me, I really started noticing visible results about four to five weeks in. And again, that really requires some consistency. I do find that it also helps a little bit with hyperpigmentation. If I had to choose just one device to keep and ditch all the rest of the things that I have, it would be a really hard choice because I love the devices that I do use regularly. But the red LED has the most science-backed data to support the efficacy on aging skin. So when it comes to picking an LED light, choosing a flexible design is really important. It is so much more comfortable and the LED light gets really close to the skin. Now I would suggest not using this immediately after a treatment because when the skin is broken open from mesotherapy, microneedling, or a chemical peel, 
you don't want anything sitting directly on the skin. That's where a table light that gives a little space between the LED and the skin is really important. So if you are brand new to red LED light and you're thinking about trying it, there are so many options available that it can be a little overwhelming deciding. I will say that I regret using and investing money in a cheaper device up front. I think I spent about $197 on my first mask, thinking I was saving $100 or so. And ultimately I ended up purchasing the Boost mask myself, which was about $500. So that initial $200 I spent thinking I was saving ended up being a waste. I don't use that device at all anymore. So that's just something to keep in mind that sometimes if you plan to use a device consistency consistently over a long period of time, really do your research and make sure you're spending your money wisely and avoid the mistake that I made wasting that first $200 on a really uncomfortable hard plastic mask. So my objective here at Gorgeously Aging is to never just push products on you. It's always to research, use the products myself, and really recommend things that I think may help you on your aging journey. So if you're using red LED light on your face or body, please share what you're using and how you've liked it and how it's benefited your skin in the comment section below. I always love hearing from you guys. Your feedback helps other women in making decisions about what they purchase. Thank you so much for being here and spending a little bit of your time with me today. I appreciate you all so much sending virtual hugs and please remember, be good to yourselves and to others. I will see you next time. Lots of love. Thank you.